Hi everyone, for today's video I'm gonna talk about the first episode of Dragon Ball Daima. Dragon Ball Daima is a Japanese anime television series produced by Toei Animation. It is the sixth televised animated installment in the Dragon Ball franchise, and a prequel to Dragon Ball Super. It is also one of the last installments to have been written by the franchise creator Akira Toriyama, who sadly passed away this year. And gotta be honest, a lot of people weren't too excited when they saw the trailer for the series, which fans nicknamed it Dragon Ball Rugrats. But after Toriyama's untimely death, people decided to give it a second chance. So let's check it out. So the series begins with a recap of what the Dragon Balls are and what they can do. In addition, it mentions who Goku is and what he does, and it just recaps Dragon Ball Z. We are then in the Demon Realm, where we are introduced to Goma and Degesu, who is Shin's younger brother, as they see the highlights of the Buu Saga and with higher quality animation. And during this recap, they find out about Earth's Dragon Balls and how they work. And after the death of Deborah, Goma becomes the new king of the Demon Realm. Then we meet Dr. Erensu, who is Degesu's older sister and scientist working for Deborah. However, now that Deborah's dead as fuck and Goma threatens to cut her funding, Dr. Erensu says, what if the people who defeated Majin Buu decide to invade the Demon Realm? Terrified of this notion, Goma and Degesu decide to use Earth's Dragon Balls to make the Z Fighters into children in order for them not to pose any threat to the Demon Realm. Oh, and Goma also wants another wish. <laughs> Oh, and it turns out the Demon Realm has their own Dragon Balls, however they are protected by robot creatures called Tamagami. And so, both Goma and Degetsu wait for the creator of the Demon Realm's Dragon Balls, Neva, in order to go to Universe 7. And it turns out they are not the only ones heading there. That's fucking sus. Meanwhile, the Sea Fighters celebrate Trunks' ninth birthday, and it's going well, as you can see. What an asshole! Oh, and the Supreme Kai are there too, explaining how they are now separated because of Boo. Also, Gohan isn't there because he is studying, and yeah, I know that feeling. Anyways, after eating, both Goku and Vegeta start training. Then, Goma and Degetsu and Neva arrive at Kami's lookout. There, Neva uses his power to collect Earth's Dragon Balls and restored them good as new. Then, they tries to stop them but gets knocked out by Degetsu. He then summons Shenron and Goma announces his wish. <laughs> We're bound. And the episode ends there. And so far it's going good. The animation's great as always, and the fight scenes are badass. And the comedy still hits perfectly. But so far, this episode is just a setup for the series arc. So yeah, we have to stay tuned for more. As for the villains, eh, they seem decent, alright. But the one that comes off as the most sinister is Dr. Eren Sue, as she is the most cunning of all of them. But overall, this episode is a decent start to the series itself, and I can't wait to see more, so stay tuned for the series review. Hopefully I get to finish this one at least.
And that was the video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos just like this. Oh, and if you like my work, support the channel at Ko-Fi. There you can support me with as little as a dollar a month, and you get to have your names in the credits. And if you do support me, I thank you very much, and I appreciate it very much. So stay safe out there, and goodbye.